to the best family on YouTube. Good morning. So I was thinking about this quote, and I do this periodically. If standing up for yourself burns a bridge, the bridge was nowhere to begin with. The bridge was never even there to begin, and it never needed to be there to begin with. So if that burns a bridge towards for standing up for yourself, then why was it even there? I've lived a very positive life, if you will. Have a lot of weird outcomes in life. I've had friends leave because I stood up for myself. I've also had people tell me, I, you're weird, man. Why, why are you doing this whole YouTube thing? Why are you doing this? Why are you doing that? And then I tell these people, burn, burn a bridge. So they burned the bridge and the bridge was never there to begin with. Why? Friends come and go. Family come and go. It's who you surround yourself with that makes a family. Blood or not, family could be family, regardless of who's around. Just saying. I've been around a block a few times where family was never family burnt bridges with people that I wanted to burn bridges with and there's a couple bridges that I've burnt that I didn't want to but with life comes responsibilities and re the responsibilities come with just different aspects on life if you will life has a way of telling you <laughs> what you need to prepare for and life tells you hey this is what we're going to do. You're going to like it. Oh, well. You're going to like it. And you're going to deal with it. But knowing that. And having the outlook on life I have. I always spin it off into a something positive. Why are you sitting at a red light? Is it. Stopping you from getting somewhere? Probably. Is it stopping you from getting in the car wreck? Possibly. Why is this guy slowing? Or why is this guy blah 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 whatever it is always have a positive outlook on life never be negative the moment where you're negative is where it's always bad I mean we already have enough people around the world my gaming channel is at like 1384 now and this channel is at 18 subscribers which is insane I enjoy making content and enjoy making vlogs for you guys i know it's gonna be a slow ride but it's okay so what i've done for the past few years is i've taken a huge step back just in life just in just to taking a huge step back being quiet and there's only a handful of people. I'm not going to mention names. That, that's not what I'm doing. But there's a handful of people that looked at me and go, Are you okay? I'm like, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm chill. I'm chilling. And most of those people sit there and go, No, you're not. You're not okay. What are you dealing with mentally, physically, and emotionally? And I tell them I'm fine. I'm chilling. I'm great. But sometimes opening up to people is a different way of looking at it. It's okay to be vulnerable. I know that's coming from a man. Oh, that's, that's a dangerous thing. No. It, it's okay to call someone. Men are equivalent to a lot of... A lot. You know? We're, nowadays, we can't even say certain things. We can't do certain things as men are supposed to. Um... It's okay though, because that's just life. But the way I always said it is life has opportunity. The opportunities are depending on what you have set course in front of you. And the way I'll do it is the last 10 years of my life, 10 years, I've been working hardcore on YouTube, 
on and off for the last 10 years. But between 2021 to 2022, even to 2023, but the whole 2021 to 2022, I've been working hardcore January 1st to January 1st. Working hardcore on that YouTube channel. Working hard on the gaming. Working hard on this one. Now, it's the next year. This is year two. January 1st, 2023 to 2024. I'm going to work hard, harder than ever on this channel. On the gaming and on this one. I'm going to work hardcore on both channels. Why? Because that's a dream of mine. I dream to be this person that people look up to. You know, like, um, a lot of people told me, last year was your year. That, that was a great year for you. You became a YouTuber. <laughs> getting noticed in the public, getting noticed in the streets. I didn't think that was going to come with the territory. I knew about it, but I didn't think anything of it. But, it's how you surround yourself with. It's the people that you surround yourself with is your future. Surround yourself with wise people, you're going to become wise. And then your wisdom teeth get out, and then there goes all your wisdom. <laughs> no, but seriously. I have a lot of wisdom and a lot of motivational speeches because I've been around the block. I've been around people who have lived different lives. Which just teaches you a lot about people. I mean, it teaches you how to read. It teaches you how to look at life differently. And who you can and cannot trust. Uh, it, it's different, yeah. Sure. But the one thing that life has taught me is never be afraid to stand. If someone's bashing you for you, it's okay to sit there. And stand for what you believe in. And no matter what it is. If, if the bridges are being burnt. The bridge was never there to begin with. It was there to hurt you. It was there to not support you. <clears throat> if you can't be you around certain some people. The bridge is. Sorry but the bridge is already gone. And it's time for you to step off the bridge. And let it burn. And that's why I take a huge step back in life because I look at everyone. Friendships, relationships, whatever it is. Friendships in general. I look at them and go, is this going to hurt me? Or is this something that's going to benefit me? Whatever it is. I do that in every single aspect of life. Every scenario. I run it through my head. I know it's a different... But this is a little thing that I wanted to talk to you guys about. Is if you're standing up for what you believe in and standing up for you and the bridge is being burnt, the bridge is never there to begin with. I'll see you guys in the next one no matter what you're doing. I upload on this channel every week. <laughs> Almost said the gaming routine, but that's okay. I upload on this channel every week. No matter what you're doing, once a week, I upload on this one. For your New Year's resolutions, start this week. January 1st. What is your New Year's resolution? And it, don't let it go, don't do the big ones first. Do the small ones that lead up to the big one. And then the big one isn't so big. Going to the gym once a week. Okay, that's a big goal. Start off small. And then hold yourself to it. Oh, I want to go to the gym every day. You're going to fail. Start off small. And then once you get to the big stuff, it's going to be easy. It's an easy ride. A lot of people fail. That, hey, I'm going to start off with the big stuff. And you're going to fail. That that's fail. You're, you're making yourself a failure. What I have on my wall is I always have what I want throughout the day, throughout the week, throughout the year. I already got all my stuff set. Why? It's easy. 
the reason why I could do it for so long, for 12 months, 5 years, 10 years, whatever it is, because I could see it, and I can get it, whatever it is. But hopefully you guys get something out of this, hopefully. I'll see you guys next week, Monday. Content is motivational as well. I'll see you guys in the next one.